Hey, what's going on, guys? Tanmay for Simple Snippets, and welcome back to another video. And this is a special video wherein I'm going to be suggesting you a free Android application which will help you improve your C++ programming skills. So with that being said, let's get started. So as some of you may know, I'm also an Android developer and I have around 18 to 20 Android applications on the Google Play Store, most of which are from educational domain. So recently I just completed C++ programming on our channel. So we have around 50 to 60 video tutorial playlist which covers all the procedural as well as object oriented paradigm of C++ programming for beginners and intermediate developers. So if you've been watching those videos, I have a good news for you and I have a C++ programming app specially for you guys and it is a free Android application. So I'm going to be showing you some of the features of that app and as you can see on the screen, I'm already recording my mobile phone screen. So let me just quickly show you that app. So go to your play store, just type in C++ programming. And as you can see on the screen, the second application is my application, which is named as C++ programming with output. And the company name is shown as IntelliSense, which is one of my startup companies wherein I develop Android applications. So just click on that app. You can see I've already installed it and it's giving me an option to open. If you scroll down, you can see some of the features that is that is already has. You can see from the screens as well. And you can see the installs, which is 100,000, which is a huge number. And you can also see it's rated 4.3, which means it is pretty good. And let me just show you by opening the app. It's around 1.3 MB. You can quickly install it. And the best part, guys, this application also works offline. So I'll just show you all the features. So if you open the app, it will show you six different modules. The first one is simple C++ programs. The second one is practical C++ programs. The third and the fourth one are from different domains. So that is the first one is computer graphics. So if you are an IT student and if you have this computer graphics subject, you definitely must be having the practicals of that subject. So the practicals are usually conducted in C++ programming. And similarly for data structures also, it is a totally different subject, but the practicals are conducted in C++. So all the programs will be there under that topic. And lastly, to cover the theory, I have Viva slash interview questions as well as university C++ questions. So let me just quickly show you the different modules. So if you click on simple C++ programs, it will open you this list of programs, which is for beginners. And you can see I have around 25 programs. So if you are just starting off with C++, you'll get all these programs. So if I just click on any of the program, say for example, addition of two numbers, you can see the complete program with proper indentation and highlighting. And the best part is that you can also see this output in the black box. So you can see there is a black rectangular box wherein the output is also printed. One more amazing feature is that you can directly share this entire program along with its output with your friends. So you can see a yellow share button, just click on it and it will give you an option to share with your friends on WhatsApp or Gmail or any other social media sharing app. So if I click on WhatsApp, I can just send it to any of my friends. So I'm just selecting one of my friend over here and you can see the entire C++ program is already typed. And if I click on send, it will share that program along with the output. So coming back to the program, you can also copy the entire program to clipboard and then paste it in another document or you can share it separately. You also have search feature. So if I click on the search tab, I type in factorial. You can see factorial of a number program comes up and similarly you can search for different programs over here. So this was simple C++ program module. The next module is practical C++ program. So if you're an IT student and if you have C++ programming as a subject, definitely you'll have practical programs and practical sessions. So these practical programs are a little complicated, but they are specially for you guys and for those who have practicals of C++. So you can see there are around 71 practical programs. And if you practice all of these, and if you see all of these, I'm pretty sure you'll score very good in your exams and practical exams. So again, you have search feature and same. If I open any of the program, you can see array selection sort program. The entire program is typed out along with the output in the black rectangular box. You can copy and share this program as well. Now, as I mentioned, this app also works offline. So let me just quickly turn off my Wi-Fi and show you how it works. So now I have turned off my Wi-Fi. So I don't think there will be any ad pop up now. So coming to the computer graphics module, I have programs on computer graphics like program for DDA line drawing algorithm, midpoint circle algorithm. So these are all different algorithms and graphic algorithms in computer graphics as a subject. So there are again 20 programs on computer graphics. 
then coming to data structures we have programs based on data structure concept like stack queue linked list heap binary search tree and what not so are again 20 different programs on data structures and lastly coming to the theoretical part we have viva slash interview questions so you can see if there are an n number of questions at least around 100 questions are there so if i click on any of the question say for example what is c out the answer will be there in dark bold black letters or black words you can share this or copy this so it's pretty easy to use and very user friendly very simple app this is not for like very professional and pro developers but definitely it is amazing for if you are a beginner or an intermediate level student especially for IT students because it has both theory as well as practicals so the last module is university C++ questions now no matter which university you are from there are certain important questions which are pretty much common and very commonly asked in all university exams so these are the list of 26 important questions which are pretty common in every exam so say for example explain inheritance with its type so if i just open this question you can see i have a complete theoretical answer which is proper formatted and it also has diagrams for representation purpose so you can see multiple inheritance hierarchical inheritance multi-level inheritance and so on so we have different questions with explanation with program examples and proper diagrams as well so these are the six different modules then on top you can see there is link to the website link to our youtube channel and there is one more green link which is this one you can see which is a network security app which is again an educational app so you can check that out as well so yeah this was about the c++ programming app that i wanted to share with you guys the most amazing feature is this works offline and moreover this is a free android application currently it is only on android and not on ios i still have to get into ios development but hopefully in future i'll develop an ios app for the same so let me know how this app was quickly go ahead and install the app try it out and tell me how you find this app is it helpful can there be any improvements you can let me know in the comments of this video and let me know if you like such kind of videos wherein i give you suggestions on different educational apps tech educational apps tech educational softwares and websites which will help you improve your knowledge and improve your skills so if you like this video give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and make sure you subscribe to this channel peace